Well, today at noon, Galinda community members will serve and deliver to shut ins and the elderly for the 17th week of their senior lunch at Galinda Baptist Church. And they're looking to serve even more seniors and shut ins in the Galinda and Chilton area. We have some fantastic people in Galinda and they we take care of each other. Galinda Baptist Church member Wanda Ray practices what she preaches. Each Friday, she cooks, serves, and sends Galinda community members with meal deliveries, all with a smile. The Lord put it on my heart about people that were shut in and needed a little bit of help with food and stuff. Each Friday, 10 women have the church's fellowship hall smelling like heaven meets home cooking. We're delivering to 28 just here in Galinda and uh, it depends on who comes to lunch, how many we serve here. Sometimes we serve four and sometimes we serve close to 30. These deliveries and the labor of love means the world to some. I love the meals. I love a lot. Meatloaf, oh my gosh. <laughs> to a recipient, it means less worry. I just put my little meal in the refrigerator, come back and then later on, I, I'm, I'm good to go. <laughs> For Wanda, it's about the golden rule. And, um, next year, it might be me. But until then, I'm gonna be up here cooking <laughs> with all these fantastic ladies. <laughs> And in case you were wondering why people come back for more week after week, she shared their secret ingredient. Love. Just love. Well, that food looked, and I'm sure it smelled good, mm -hmm. but I, I do like what she said about taking care of people. I mean, that's, that's a Texas thing, especially in Central Texas. We've seen a lot of that. Absolutely, absolutely. And I mean, these ladies, they were so inspiring. I mean, they started cooking at 830. They started delivering at 11 and then they served people who came to the church at noon and they even put me to work. I've never been so tired. They are wanting whoever comes to get those deliveries or put themselves on the list for the deliveries or come to the church. They do ask for donations, but emphasize it is not required.